I need your cleansing, O Lord. I need your cleansing, O Lord. This is the prayer of everybody who seeks for God's presence, God's help, God's mercy, and God's power. Reading from Matthew chapter eight, verse two to three, the Bible reads, "And behold, there came a leper and worshipped him, saying." Lord, if Thy wilt, Thy counsel, make me clean. And Jesus put forth His hand and touched him, saying, "I will be Thou clean." And immediately his lepros was cleansed. His lepros was cleansed. I can really pause on this and say the word Luke. The word Luke means Jesus was not expecting the leper. That means it was like a surprise that just happened in the middle of the discussion, in the middle of the sermon, in the middle of healing, in the middle of prayer, in the middle of giving the speech to the audience, the multitude. But the unique thing is that the leper expected Jesus. That's why. He bowed down and worshipped Jesus Christ. You, you know, this is really important that the leper expected Jesus, although it was like a surprise to Jesus that the leper came near to Jesus. But the leper expected that I have something that I'm going to find out. And I'm going to have it. I'm going to hold it. I'm going to be given by Jesus once I meet Him. And the leper, he didn't. He did that because there was something about him that he knew it is in Jesus, and the pushing factor was in him. That just go forward. Just not give up. Don't try to say no to yourself. Just say yes. I can make it. There was a reason that led him to seek Jesus. There was a reason. I'm telling you because most of the time we think the only thing that will come to us is what God really made it for us to be said. But I tell you, the pushing factor within you. In a part, in a being, in a position that you can push yourself and say, "God, I, I, I know you can do something for me. I know, God, you can change the situation. I know, God, you can speak a different thing from what other people are speaking against me. I know, God, you have got the revelation that is going to take me somewhere. I know, God, once you say yes, there is no any evil power that is going to say no." What I want to say is that clear that the need you have is one of the things that takes you to God, because we depend on God, and so our needs pushes us to God to show that still God is God. Even if we can have money, God is God. Even if we can be in the good house, God is God. Even if we're being educated, God will still be God because we are dependent before God. When God sees the worship, when He sees the 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 worship in you, He deals with your situations. He deals with your problems. He deals with your needs through His Son Jesus Christ. Oh my God! You know what I'm trying to let you know is that God will never, never, never act to anything until He sees. The worship, he sees the tears that come from the heart, the inner part of your heart, until he sees the true fast <laughs> that you need him, until he find out that you're looking for his help, until he sees the worship, then he will act in you. In fact, Jesus stretched out his hand and touched his the need of that leper. This is the same that is going to happen to you. That Jesus is going to touch your need, all、oh, your matter, all、oh, your problem, and He will really work on removing it with the statement, as He said to the leper, "I will be thou clean. I will be thou 
thou clean. I assure you that when God is in your side, nothing will break you. Nothing will make you not receive his healing. Nothing is going to make you silent. Nothing is going to make you quit the position that God has given and gifted you. With God on your side, leprous, pride, lies, hears, errors, and many other things will leave you in the name of Jesus Christ. He will make you clean and clean indeed. Oh my God. <laughs> May you take and take another step. As we have agreed that our motto is step by step. Let Jesus Christ take you to another step in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. And all the believers say, Amen.